this is going to be a libra reading from now until the end of the month so all that you need to know about your person your situation starting off with your collective energy what's really going on we start off with a 10 of pentacles so at this time i think you're majorly focused on just your finances your stability your balance you want all those who really wish well for you you do not want to be part of toxic connections toxic friendships uh maybe even toxic job situations you just want to be in places where you're appreciated where you're uh, treated well where you're respected okay so some of you not all might also have plans of going for higher education okay so like some of you guys are wanting to switch your jobs you are going to be very focused on your finances up till i would say march you're going to be completely focused on getting richer getting more successful in life okay just on stability majorly on the i would say financial aspect okay moving on what else to receive for you yeah we have the elephant card so the universe is also going to be on your side i feel if you are really really focused on changing your life for the better the universe will give you a lot of opportunities that could be in form of a new job a new um, i would say work situation this could be a new project that you've been waiting on some major thing that's going to give you a big name big fame okay so on that note you could also type in 888 to manifest it faster but believe in it okay don't just type it because i'm asking you to like with the elephant card i also feel like some of you who who believe in arranged marriages will definitely be presented with an offer someone who is quite your types someone your family will like someone your family will approve of someone who's more of husband material or wife material someone who is going to be there someone who's going to be stable so i feel within a span of 5 weeks most of you guys will get an opportunity to meet someone that is at your level now at your level i mean financially i mean emotionally i mean mentally this person will just fit in okay the queen of pentacles i also feel for some of you you guys are not exactly ready to jump into another connection yet you guys are still at crossroads regarding it yes you want something good but you're not fully ready for it okay now coming to relationships relationship with eight of swords you find yourself in a stagnant situation uh if you are not in a stagnant situation you're just overthinking and you are blocking yourself with your overthinking and negative thinking patterns okay whatever has happened in this past 8 days precisely is still affecting you okay you just got to get that blindfold off and you will see that it is not as bad as you might think moving forward we have two of wands like everyone you have two options either you stay where you are or you keep moving forward okay most of you guys will move forward i don't see you being stuck for long um, like maybe the next couple of days you guys will get some sort of clarity that will force you to move forward okay but you guys will be presented with a lot of opportunities and i do not just mean financially even emotionally even in terms of partnership okay now how you go about it darling that's on you in terms of your person relationship what's happening 10 of wands things are not quite going well you guys are feeling uh, this person is not taking you seriously or things are just not moving forward you guys are stuck in that same situation moving in circles you guys are expecting them to do the work they are expecting you to understand their situation it's going on bro okay regarding your person what are they up to yeah with the hermit card this person is giving you a hard time they 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 keep asking for more time and you you're getting exhausted you you you're feeling like this is a dead end you know like you are not very happy with where things are going in terms of your person's energy towards you the tower card they feel like you you guys are not on the same page at this moment you guys have had some sort of fight argument misunderstanding something which could have led to uh, the two of you to stay away from each other i don't think you guys are on best of terms regardless whether this is a new person past person whosoever the person on your mind i don't think you are on best of terms at least that's the energy i'm picking on okay moving on future action what do we see this person feels like this relationship is not where they want it to be 
with the knight of wands are they losing interest absolutely not but are they affected yes what's the major trigger what's the major blockage major blockage is you're expecting i don't i won't say too much but you have high expectation from a person from a situation from a relationship and this person is not able to keep up with your expectation which is leading to disappointments okay now you could let me know in the comment section as to what's happening but that is what i feel you want this person to be more serious about you this person is behaving a little childish little casual and yeah it's it's definitely getting in the way okay energies have shifted from what i feel in terms of that how will they come forward ace of swords see trust me when i say this you guys will get communication you guys will get clarity with the knight of wands this person themselves will approach you you'll have to do nothing about it just hold back meanwhile work on yourself but hold back okay in terms of their major feelings towards you at this moment they are feeling heartbroken they are feeling like this relationship is not working out they are very fearful of you leaving them for the better you know and um, yeah they do not want to share you they do not want you to replace them they are just very hurt at this moment okay what's really bothering them what's really bothering them is the fact that they fear this ending okay death card some of you guys have already in some which way broken ties with them or stopped communicating with them or hinted a breakup okay now you could tell me better but that's what i feel now coming to your energies your personal like energies when i say libra i think you're very nervous you're you're just tired how this person makes you feel half of the time you're drained out like because of all this drama they bring into your life you're tired of pretending to be normal to be okay you know to be happy and uh, this situation is affecting you to a point that sometimes you just feel like not wanting to talk to them and just getting away just wanting a break okay your feelings for now unfair i feel things have become too unfair and i cannot deal with it anymore that's your feeling that's how you feel about it we also have uh accountable all the blame fell on me and no accountability on your end it is also a major problem that your person doesn't really take accountability or responsibility for their mistakes and you have had in, like enough of this shit and dry spell i got tired of the dry spell and lack of sexual connection it's not about a sexual connection it's some it's just the reciprocity which you feel is not at your level okay and some of you guys do have this issue okay it's okay even i've had this issue in my life but this issue is triggered because of this person's action and you do not want to go oh, you can't let this happen so you don't want to go through another breakup where you feel unwanted like, like where you feel left out and that is triggering you the past wounds have definitely started to trigger you now moving on in terms of your person's honest honest feelings for you your person is hella confused about you but they are not able to move on from you they are not able to let this go i mean many of you guys could also be asking me this question if they can't choose me why can't they let me go okay with seven of wands they are making it difficult for you to stay in their life but they are also making it difficult for you to leave their life so they are just giving you something that keeps you holding on to them okay but i don't think that is enough with seven of wands they just don't want you to leave they'll do whatever they'll want to blame you for half of the shit but they will not want you to leave okay in terms of their head space head space seven of swords i mean i mean you can see a lot of seven that's in the pattern today uh, seven is usually when someone is not fully wanting to accept what is going on they are not quite taking responsibility they are not quite aware of the ongoing situation this person is a bit delusional okay and they want to believe that they are right half of the times to not take responsibility to not feel guilty this person runs from responsibility you know like it's it's good uh, as it starts but then when you start demanding more you you start expecting more that's when things start to fall apart 
okay right now many of you guys are also very triggered because this person isn't keeping well with the communication this person isn't making you feel important so a lot of things are getting in the way okay let me clarify a few things before you can move next in terms of libra energy what is libra going through we have the justice card i think what you're seeking right now is balance some of you guys have been going through a legal battle because of what this person has put you through this could be a toxic marriage for some of you um some of, some of you just want this person to take responsibility and in a way agree to your terms and conditions okay if that is the case then you will give in otherwise you're out moving next we also have seven of wands you're just trying to protect yourself you're setting some strong boundaries in a way you are defensive because you have no choice i also feel like you're very upset with the way this person has been behaving with you a little hyper okay what else in terms of your current feelings your current feelings we have the tower card uh you feel like this is just damaging you it's just affecting you it's just messing with you okay and uh, you don't want it to fall apart but you don't even see the light at the end of the tunnel some of you guys are definitely affected or very much disturbed by the ongoing events but you do not want to be the one responsible for cutting this off for good this person is very fearful that you're leaving them because you be, you've been unavailable or you've been uh, i would say avoiding it for most part of it with the tower card as feelings you're fearful of this hurting you bad and that could be one of your reasons why you're, you're wanting to leave before they could leave okay and finally in terms of your person's energies person's energy we have the world card if this person is not able to let go of their toxic patterns okay they do want to level up for you they do want uh, to give you that completion that forever that you desire but for some reason they are not able to see their own faults you know that's called toxic right but that's what's going on okay with the world card they do want to give it all to you but they are still not able to figure it out moving on we also have the empress card they could have promised you the um you know like they will want to get married they will want to have a family they would want to create with you nurture this connection with you want stability want growth but that's still in the wanting that's still in the intention but actions are quite opposite to what they have been telling and wanting to say okay moving on now finally we have queen of wands in terms of what you can expect this person is still wanting to take action they will make a bold move okay the problem is the uh, their lack of confidence uh, this person is extremely insecure okay they they do not feel good about themselves even if even, even if they are very good looking people on the outside but inside they do not quite see themselves at your level and that always gets in the way besides they are very ambitious they just want to focus on their finances and they are not able to decide as to what they should be focusing on and you for major part of it feel unwanted because again uh, the you you do not see the efforts put from their side okay and this person is also very bossy you know uh, like when you know someone is on, like only controlling when they feel like they are going to lose the situation no one is going to control it for the sake of it people people only control it because they feel like they are on the losing end they, they, they just want things to be going their way okay moving on now in terms of your person's honest intentions for now honest intentions we have page of pentacles page of pentacles is all about messages wanting to share some news wanting to reach out wanting to start fresh so this person will reach out regardless whether they are blocked you they are away from you i do not care as to what is going on trust me when i say this this person will reach out but what will happen after that with the empress card again it starts off again is it a false start is it a real start they they want to maintain a good bond with you they do want a new chance for most part of it they want to clear the doubts i don't think they're just coming in to keep you stuck i think their intentions are positive they do want to change themselves they don't want to give you a hard time 
they will want to build up uh, uh, or build up the connection and with the, like the judgment card this person wants a fresh new start with you this person does want it all with you with the empress world judgment i do feel like this person wants to be serious with you okay in terms of their major thoughts i play mind games to hold your interest and make you want me more but i think it's backfiring if you don't stress over me do you even really like me that's the problem they are very insecure and they can't really be in a relationship where you know like they feel like they are on a losing end or they are not like going to be uh, playing the major part okay they will want that constant attention that constant reassurance okay my emotions for you make me feel out of control definitely they've got feelings for you no doubt about it moving on don't be fooled by social media this connection has secrets even if they are pretending that they are fine without you trust me this person is stalking you crazy okay and uh, i don't think they are wanting to replace you or wanting to toss you out and go for another connection no they still want you but this person will take some time trying to figure out i like i know most of you guys are screaming out loud saying you know i've had enough it's your life darling i'm just a reader that's going to give you guidance but uh, i feel like this is not over yet and i'm not trying to manipulate you into staying but i feel like this person will reach out and within 8 days i'm giving you a duration of 8 days there'll be some sort of clarity that you always wanted that's going to give you some bit of hope about this connection okay what like what's getting in the way what's the major issue major issue is four of wands you you both have very different ways of looking at relationship ways of looking at marriage ways of looking at being together ways of love language it's it's extremely different okay and with four of wands there's lack of balance in this connection lack of stability maybe you guys come from a very different worlds that is also getting in the way like with the sun card i also believe that this person is not very good at being consistent and um, there's something about them that makes you question their intentions towards you you can't trust them fully okay besides what's getting in the way besides they are very emotionally distant very withdrawn they don't really make you feel loved half of the times it's either uh, flirty or it's friendly conversations one kind of advice for you as you're going through this one kind of advice we have seven of pentacles i think it's time for you to give it some uh, time off what i mean by that is hold back don't have to stalk them wait on them don't do anything that is connecting to them rather just be there for yourself for now this next i would say four days just work on yourself i feel you also very triggered because uh, sometimes you feel like this person has power over you but darling it's just the opposite it's you who has power over them okay so i think you just need to get that clarity i know some some of you guys do feel sad and feel upset for what you have been going through and what you have put yourself through and you are very fearful of repeating a past toxic pattern or a cycle and uh, no you know like when you're going through something trust me it is always for the better okay if, like, even if it may feel bad there's always a lesson there's always a purpose and, you know the universe will not just toss you into a toxic relationship for the fun of it it, it is not that way okay it definitely has a bigger purpose it definitely has a bigger lesson okay so the near outcome what can we expect near outcome i'm getting temperance card moving on and i'm getting high priestess so i feel like if at all you guys have been ghosting each other you guys will find ways of working it out i also believe the intuition is not quite letting you out of this connection you still have a feeling that something is still left undone unsaid and uh, yeah that's the only hope that's keeping you alive in this connection okay temperance is all about finding that balance finding that purpose um, i feel feelings for most part of it are mutual but since you guys are hurt and you have been feeling in a very weird way about this 
you have been holding back likewise your person also has fears that you could be focusing on someone else and even they are holding back so you are very defensive so i think sometimes you just got to see the situation for what it is right and um, yeah that's what's going on with you you're wanting to give it a chance but then you're also not wanting to play okay i feel for now just just take some time off decide on it there's no necessary uh, reason for you to come to conclusion today i feel you just need some time off just need a breather go out with your friends family work on yourself and some of you guys i genuinely believe that your heart chakra is blocked and i'm getting a lot of heart chakra blockages here um, if you believe in reiki you could go for reiki now i have a partner who does reiki if you want you could come uh, by i'll definitely work it out like for some of you not for all can't do for all but yeah your heart chakra and crown chakra doesn't let you fully trust another person even if the person could be good your 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 system doesn't allow you to fully participate something always gets in the way past triggers past traumas definitely get in the way okay that being said moving on now regarding your person we have intervention expect a miracle divine intervention is pushing the two of you together we have third eye my third eye can never forget what my heart has seen the true love i feel for you we have telepathy do you hear me talking to you i need you close to me right now please respond and we have priority you are no longer an option i am making you a priority uh, actions match their words they are wanting to make you feel important now they do not want to just make you feel like an option you you're no longer an option i don't see a third party i don't see major third person influence the only issue is the mind that's getting in the way mind versus the heart that's the major trigger okay choices a decision between love and fear we fall in love by chance and stay by choice please type in 444 to manifest togetherness and stability moving on to messages so we have i miss you let's both stop running away we also have i'm going through a dark night of the soul nothing in my life is making sense this person is definitely going through a lot of triggers a lot of shift a lot of spiritual awakening okay i definitely feel like there's a deeper purpose for the two of you meeting it is not just a toxic or a, a soulmate relationship there's lot to be uncovered okay for those who can afford can 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 go for a personal reading like we can definitely check into uh, this more i feel your energy around me and i and i wonder are you thinking of me too okay now moving to their messages for you give me please give me time to situate things you are my sunshine baby you make my heart keep a bit still your mind only and i'm so stressed right now this person can decide on uh, their future actions they are very messed up okay right now how you been behaving your stand is affecting them okay i watch your social media every day stalking and i don't want to share you that's what i spoke about they are very scared of losing you those who are dealing with air sign what is happening I feel three of pentacles you some of you guys are in communication but not the communication you want this could be regarding work this could be just regarding some petty shit but most of you guys will find yourself in communication again how does this person feel about you three of wands this person is distant the problem with this individual is they are an overthinker right so sometimes you may feel like they have kept you like an option how do they truly feel about you see trust me when i say this they do love you a lot i don't think they've loved someone this much the problem is they are also judging the situation a lot they are not letting it be what it is they are judging it in a very unfair manner okay in terms of that future action future action see don't get me wrong i still believe this person is more focused on their finances than this relationship so this will take time but i do feel they will want to be on good terms with you moving to water signs what's happening with you people those dealing with water signs 
we have king of swords so most of you guys are just wanting to focus on yourself you guys are wanting to be practical you guys are keeping your sensitive and your heart aside and thinking just with your mind and your experiences okay one card for what's going on though i think with six of wands this person comes to you whenever they want you and they leave whenever they want to so i see a lot of attitude a lot of ego that gets in the way and you don't want to let this person come and go uh, on their own terms you would rather want something more balanced how are they thinking about you two of cups the problem is they they do love you there's no doubt about it but what's what's getting in the way five of wands but the problem is you guys are not as compatible as you guys should be you guys find not like find but there are always something that gets in the way uh, the way you think the way you say things the way you react to it uh, you guys are always constantly fighting arguing blaming it's still going on one card for advice advice i think let them come to you don't give them unnecessary validation i feel this person feeds on your attention and validation just avoid it for now okay one card for the near future see trust me this connection will come back regarded you do not over give i think most of you guys are over givers and that always gets in the way this time this person needs to know that they also need to put an effort whenever you ask them to put like effort they rather blame you for things saying that you know you're you're over expecting or they'll give some petty excuses to why they can't so i think you guys need to put them at uh, in in their place okay so those dealing with fire sign i feel with eight of pentacles you guys are just working on yourself just just doing um, going one day at a time this person is not quite giving you the attention that you deserve and that has been affecting you but you're not quite letting that get to your head okay in terms of their feelings for you they they do miss you the problem is they are, they were not willing to change much okay they they always refuse to change and that's the major problem we have king of wands uh, which tells me that if you guys been waiting on this person to react or reach out to you they will but i'm getting a lot of sexual energy a lot of flirty energy the problem with this person will be inconsistent if you're, if you're dealing with a fire sign this person will not make you feel emotionally loved right rather their love language is way different than yours and you'll always feel disconnected or you'll always feel disappointed okay final outcome with page of wands but they always return that's the issue okay so you'll have to make this choice or do not leave the choice on them if you if you really are comfortable uh, with giving this person time because they will take time to change they are not emotionally available that's an issue okay so you could definitely comment 555 to manifest changes moving to those dealing with earth sign what's happening we have the wheel of fortune which tells me that right now you guys are just focused on manifesting good things in your life you are not quite bothered about what went wrong with six of pen like pentacles this person will be focusing on like on you more but the problem is there could be some outside influence parents siblings friends which gets in the way of this relationship their feelings for you at this time i mean with the knight of cups they do love you there's no doubt about it their intentions intention howsoever they are not fully ready to commit okay the earth sign will take time and you'll feel like this person is bread cramming you in terms of what's blocking this connection what's blocking is they do not know what they want with you in the long term future they, they were more of looking to have fun with you even though they have feelings their intentions are still not positive okay so near outcome feel like this person is stuck on you is obsessed with you but the problem is they do not make you feel that way so you will all like you will always question their intentions and you'll always question their feelings but i do feel in the span of 4 days you guys will have this honest conversation which will give you more clarity 
okay so you could comment 666 to manifest better situations in your life if you are dealing with an earth sign so that is all from my side all those who have resonated so far please do hit the like button also let me know in the comment section uh, for those who find themselves in a complicated messed up situation you can't rely on uh, on general spreads for long you have to go for a personal spread to get more clarity you could come via etsy divine love terror by sai or you could come via whatsapp uh, we do have 25 percent discount on etsy orders thank you so much and i hope to see you soon guys cheers